what is happening what is going on the absolute bunch of legends so what i've been doing in this video is i'm going to give you a free hdri like cloud in blender it's very easy and it will allow you just to drag it in and it's very very good to an hdri with clouds really easily and it's two so you got a day scene and you got a nighttime scene so i'm going to show you where to get it how to install it and then how to use it so let's let's go and download it first so in the link in the description you can see it's over here and it is called free cloud system for blender and it allows you just to drag and drop and yeah you can see there all you need to do is you just click download okay so just download it and then what you want to do is once it's downloaded you want it will be zipped so you just want to unzip it okay you want to extract it find a place to put it i'll put mine in the desktop so it's over there then you want to go back into blender and then the way you install this or add it to blender is you're going to go to edit preferences and you're going to go to file pass asset library and look for wherever you found yours so mine is here you can just add plus and then you just look for it so mine is there you just click it add it but i've already done that once it's been added all you need to do is you just click here save preferences and you can go out of here now you can see everything is dark so i'm trying to look and now how do you use this all you need to do is you click here go to your asset browser drag this up and click there and look for kh environment and all you need to do is you just drag this in like that and you've got an hdri and you've got a nighttime one too it's a little bit darker so let's go with the daytime one and you can see how nice this will look so i'm just going to click there and you can see you can change some things so you can change the air and you can change the dust you can change the strength so you can bring it up you can bring it down let's make it 0 0.1 and you can change the ozone so it's allowing you to play around with things you can adjust the strings so if i click here strength of the cloud so you can bring this up to make it more we can make it like that so you can then make it less and you've got this and the scale cloud scale so you can just randomize it which looks pretty nice detail so it allows you just to change things a little bit you can bring this down bring this up cloud color so like i said it allows you to play around with these kind of things you can animate it as well and it's really that easy so you can see if i add a scene mesh plane and i just go in here s scale this up and i just add like grass or something so i'm just going to make this smaller click here and you can just see how nice it will light the scene i'm just going to add grass quickly boom okay boom okay and you can see how nice that actually lights your scene makes the grass look good the grass in the clouds so yeah it is an easy way to add an hdri in blender it looks nice it's got a built-in sunlight and you can customize things which is pretty cool so yeah hopefully you enjoyed the video make sure you check it out i've got a link in the description it's completely free and install it's really easy to do and you've got a nighttime scene like i said here asset browser bring this in and click there and you've got a dark nighttime scene then you can obviously add lighting but it looks pretty cool so let's add this one back in there and hopefully enjoy the video. Make sure you check out my Patreon. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.